Hey everyone, I'm Keith from Fab Studio. Today we're going to SP Fab Lab for their embroidery machine. It's a short course, we're just gonna have a look at what they have and how the machine works. So uh, let's go. Okay, now we are at the Fab Lab and we're supposed to be downloading a PNG vector file to send to the machine. I'll choose a guitar, okay, a lesser um, pattern, lesser detailed kind of uh, picture. Just drag and drop it. Okay. Enlarge it. Auto punch. Okay, so now we're trying another method to uh, trace the image. This one pretty much it includes the, some kind of infill. This is going to give the sewing or the final product more details and also helping the, the, the software to be able to detect better. We can actually choose a different kind of fill stitch. This, this is pretty much defining how the machine will sew and stitch your end product. friends are still inside the studio and I'm just coming out to kind of like tell you how it was and uh, yeah the machine is really quite amazing it's like a 3d printer except that it does the sewing for you uh, I really can't uh, wait to see the final product okay let's go in uh, avoid keep running go through the entrance and go through the arrow follow the arrow then you cut okay it's very easy then you put Fully sewed nicely, smooth, and some of the threads that needs to be taken off. Other than that, I think this machine is really good to go. Anybody can embark on in terms of embroidery digital machines. I guess at the front, perhaps about putting the thread in uh, within the grooves, I think that takes a bit of a practice. But other than that, I think the machine really did a good job in terms of sewing onto a fabric without manual approaches so we hope that everyone can just try out the machine so thanks for watching and stay tuned